If you look up close, there's so many different uh, personalities, different characters inside them. Like how many beings are in this one, you know, and that the wood grain looks so fine and soft. Artist, curator, and author Leo Lia Shragi has traveled around the world meeting indigenous creatives. We've seen uh, in the last few years the exponential rise of indigenous contemporary practice. And with this exhibition, you can see also that many artists who work in customary forms are innovating and they're also taking their just place in the contemporary art space. Ishragi eventually landed the job of indigenous arts curator at the Fine Arts Museum of Montreal, where they are admiring Taltan Klingit artist Dempsey Bob's exposition which launched about a month before they started their new job. It feels like a really a beautiful alignment of energies and the right kind of opening to Indigenous artists of the Americas uh, for someone like me coming from a bit further afield. Ashragi is a member of the Samoan clans of Samoan Tafa and Tautua from the Samoan Islands in the Pacific Ocean. As an oceanic Indigenous person, uh, water is a sacred connector, it's a highway, uh, and so the connection with the rivers and the lakes here is a, a way that for me to really uh, feel grounded and connected to everyone. Ishragi identifies as Fa'a Fine, a Samoan fluid gender identity, roughly translating to in the manner of a woman. There are also Fafatama people in Samoan culture, roughly translating to in the manner of a man. Fafafine and Fatama are really uh, known for being the, the language teachers, the uh, storytellers, um, the dancers, the, the aesthetes. Uh, in other archipelagos, a similar gender formation would be the people who hold cultural knowledge and who are kind of like uh, extra parents. In their role as Indigenous Arts Curator, Ashragi so says they will bring more programming for Indigenous peoples locally and internationally, including welcoming community groups and more Indigenous solo exhibitions. I'm really looking forward to continuing to champion Indigenous practice from here and from around the world in this place. It's, uh, it's well needed in Quebec. Emilia Fournier, APTN National News, Montreal.